Mercuria Behanu says he has failed to stop smoking and chewing cut, a popular stimulant leaf in East Africa and Yemen. For the past two years, despite resolving to stop for the past two years, I still keep smoking and chewing cut despite my resolutions to stop. However, I am determined to stop in 2004, Bernhanu said. Ethiopians in the diaspora are also returning home to celebrate the new year. So, are you wondering to know what year Ethiopia is in in 2021? Take a wild guess and enjoy yourself. With different events happening around the world, it is difficult to know what times we live in. Ethiopia celebrates New Year seven years behind the Gregorian calendar. Hello everybody, welcome to Attitude Trending. Let's get on with it. Ethiopia celebrates New Year seven years behind Gregorian calendar. On September 12th, Ethiopians will be celebrating the dawn of the New Year 2004. For the initiated, this may sound anomalous, but Ethiopia, a country with more than 80 million people, is behind time, literally. The Horn of Africa, country uses its own calendar. For them, it is still 2003, which began on September 11, 2010, of the Gregorian calendar. There is a 276 year difference between the Ethiopic and Coptic calendars. In spite of this, the Ethiopic calendar is closely associated with the Bruce and the different calculations influenced by the Coptic Church and the Ethiopic Orthodox, the Tehwathido Church. Based on the ancient Coptic calendar, the Ethiopic calendar is 7 to 8 years behind the Gregorian calendar, owing to alternate calculations in determining the date of the Annunciation of the Birth of Jesus Christ. Ethiopia's New Year, Enkutatash, means the gift of jewels. Enkutatash tradition dates back to the time when the famous Queen of Sheba returned from her expensive jaunt to visit King Solomon in Jerusalem. Her chiefs are believed to have welcomed her by showering her with gifts of jewels or inko, but Enkutatash is not exclusively a religious holiday. The Spring Festival which has been celebrated since early times, also symbolizes the end of the rainy season, accompanied by dancing and singing across the green countryside. It is also a season of exchanging formal New Year greetings cards among the urban sophisticated, as well as the traditional bouquet of flowers. Confusion Ethiopia's use of different calendars has always confused foreigners visiting the country. Keeping appointments with locals is more often than not a nightmare for foreign visitors who are always encouraged to make it clear when they are making appointments with locals on whether they are referring to local or European time. For example, Europeans who unknowingly fix appointments for 9am are surprised when their Ethiopian counterparts turn up at 9pm. Ethiopians, who usually don't use anti-meridian AM and post-meridian time PM timing begin their day at 01 AM and end at 12 PM, which is sunset local time, wishes. With the new year approaching, Ethiopians have already shifted into a festive mood. The dawn of the new year, no matter how tough the situation in the country might be, has some power to make people believe that things will turn out for the better. For many Ethiopians, it is time when new resolutions are considered, and when the new year arrives, people seem to wish to change not only things they have control over, but also things out of their sphere of their reach. In the meantime, many Ethiopians have been busy shopping ahead of the celebrations in Addis Ababa. Home to the around 5 million people, the celebrations are already underway as shown by the busy streets, and for most Ethiopians, Christians and Muslims alike, it must to be slaughter a sheep or goat. There's also time when the Ethiopian tradition of chicken stew is most popular in kitchens across the country. Ethiopians spend their new year mainly at home, partaking traditional food and drink. There's usually Women's tasks to prepare food and drinks while men are tasked in the chasing of goats or sheep, as well as providing money to buy gifts for the holiday. Men, as heads of families, 
are also supposed to slaughter the sheep or goats early in the morning of the new year. More wishes! The climax of the new year celebration is when most Ethiopians finally make resolutions for the year end. It is commonplace for people to resolve to stop indulging in unhealthy habits such as smoking or drinking beer. Mesfin Mekonen, 36, a father of one who hopes to stop smoking next year. It is really my hope to completely stop smoking the next year, he says. I promised myself, my wife and son, so 2004 will be a good year for my family. Like Mekonen, Tizita, Tesma, 27, who works for a private company, 2004 will be a special year. I'm preparing to get married. That is one of my plans for the new year. Sema 8 But while many resolutions are made, most are broken, as Ethiopians usually never live up to them. Mercuria Behanu says he has failed to stop smoking and chewing cut, a popular stimulant leaf in East Africa and Yemen. For the past two years, despite resolving to stop for the past two years, I still keep smoking and chewing cut despite my resolutions to stop. However, I am determined to stop in 2004. Bernhanu said, Ethiopians in the diaspora are also returning home to celebrate the new year. So, are you wondering to know what year Ethiopia is in in 2021? Take a wild guess and enjoy yourself. Make sure you stick around for more insights. Just remember to hit the like and subscribe button for more awesome videos like these. Thank you for watching. This article is brought to you by AfricaCarePort.com.